What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to some more Gun Home. In the last episode, we made it. We found another secret panel after getting upstairs from the basement. And this seemed to be Sam and Looney's secret panel. It's so creepy looking. It's like, oh god, why? Why would they want to do this? And how come there's so many secret passages that no one else knows about in this house? I don't know. There's that flickering lamp over there. Hey, Lenny, sorry my mom has such a bitch lately. She probably should not leave this letter out when she chats talking to her mother. She's probably ever around since the forest is like an hour away, and then when she is home, she takes it out on you, like, because you're not a member of the family, she knows you won't call her on it. And I'm sorry. Haha, <laughs> it's okay, I know. She's just jealous of our cool and freewheeling lifestyle. I feel sorry for you. I'm lucky my mom lives in Florida. You have, um, blah, blah, blah. You have to have a mom every day. Sorry, but I need to bring up the mom thing like that. I know, I shouldn't complain. No, I'm being serious. My mom is a psycho Christian, and her husband, Don, is a complete tool. Living in Florida with him is her eternal punishment in my mind. So you wouldn't rather live with your mom in Florida? Guess that's a definite yes. <laughs> okay. Interesting crap textbook. In Espanol! Maybe that has something to do with Looney's... Oh, maybe it has to do with college, actually. To say, do, oh, yeah, I already read this. Did you wait? Did I? Services needed for experienced personnel director. We would like to offer you a position, regional commerce manager director. Oh, nice. Our mother's advancing. To fill your previous position, now posting it would be the regional building located for Bill Holmes. Much more giving for your daily commute, please. Spawn. Blah blah blah. blah. Cool. So while her her father is like failing at writing stuff, her mother is actually doing better, which is the opposite I thought would happen. So maybe this would be the downfall of both their family members, but I guess not. All right? Well, this, oh, but don't move that. Don't lose that thing. Earth, wind, fire, hearts, other stuff, other elements. Uh huh. Uh huh. Say anything? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Say. Sam, the skull was the coolest thing I found in Mexico, and it was like three bucks. American. I love it. Merry Xmas. Love you. Uh, P.S. Treasure it always. Where the heck? Is this it? No. That's a whole bunch of newspaper. Where's the skull? I'm scared. Is that why this place ha is haunted now? Because there's a freaking skull in the house? God damn, why would you guys keep a skull in this house when you know there's scary things going on? I was just seeing if you could see anything in that room from here, but I guess not. Like, I don't know, that'd be a cool Easter egg. Like, stuff like this. Like, if I looked here and then I saw something in that room, like a person standing there, and then when I went there, they weren't standing there, and I could only see that person through this window, that would be so creepy. Like, I'm getting goosebumps just thinking about it. But I don't know. I don't, I don't even know what this game is trying to be still. Okay. Search education. There's some down here. Hi, Jan. I got two tickets for uh, blah, blah. Uh, but my girlfriend says she doesn't want it, so her taste in music rears its ugly head again. So that leaves me with an extra ticket, and I thought you might be interested more than clearing bush in the freezing rain, right? Oh, is she cheating? Oh, she's cheating on her husband with the management, and that's why she's advancing, isn't it? That's cr oh, oh, forgot about that creepy light over there. The closet. Oh, this, okay, maybe this is still a downfall of the family. What's this room? I haven't been in there yet. Oh, that looks like the last room in the game, actually. Let's see if we can go outside, too, but I don't think we will. I need another copy of that. It's plenty of for all. Samantha, blah, blah, blah. Description. Distributing inappropriate materials on school grounds. Phone call to students' parents out of school suspension. Sam, since you refused to hear us out this afternoon, your mother and I are putting this in writing so that we are absolutely clear. You are grounded for the rest of the month from social and telephone something. I don't know what that says, and I can't really zoom in on it. Oh, no. What I had an interesting talk with Mom and Dad tonight. God dang it. I can't read it One you're never going to need to have. I mean, you've known, right? I've known. I've known since, like, she -Ra. Mom and Dad didn't, I guess. But they saw the zine and the stuff on the locker, the and they were like, 
Is there something we should know about you and Lonnie? And so here's the thing. I was prepared for them to be mad, or disappointed, or start crying, or something. But they were just in denial. You're too young to know what you want. You and Lonnie are just good friends. You just haven't met the right boy. It's a phase. That's what I didn't see coming. That they wouldn't even respect me enough to believe me. Well, joke's on them. Because they're in for one very long phase. Huh. Anything in this? Nope. <laughs> What's this say? First off, congratulations, Janice Greenberg, Girls Director, and I must say congratulations because, come on, you're going to take the job, right? What are you waiting for? An engraved invitation? Call them back, but in the meantime, let's discuss this little outing you had with one of the favorite flannel-clad hunk. What a blast, but you sound like you're um, reading a lot into it. Wait, reading a lot into an innocent night out. You sure there's something then? There? You said he has an out-of-town girlfriend. Are you sure they're not serious? Okay, so we have to figure it out, Wilson. Okay. So did the dad leave? Well, it doesn't sound like it by the fact like Sam was just talking to like both their parents in the in the tape over here. So I'm confused. Um okay, I didn't get to finish reading this. Telephone privileges for me, anything except gone to and from school. I understand you are going through ooh, but we cannot allow you to to continue with this kind of behavior at school, clearly. Once privileges are reinstated, we can't allow you to have your bedroom door closed while Lonnie is home. This is the last word on the matter. Get back on course, so this won't happen again. Dad. Silly dad. Little does do they know. Little do they know. Huh! I chuck our racers on you. Huh! Yeah. That'll teach him. Stop it, Rain. Stop it. Stop. Look like at greenhouse out there! Holy crap, this house is a lot. Uh, Excellent warrior, don't, don't give up on this, honey. Oh. Oh, so the mother seems supportive still, but that's probably because she's a cheating hoe. That light doesn't want to turn on. Is there a reason for that? Look like there's nothing in the garbage. Okay. Where's this now? God damn, this house is massive. I thought we were getting. Well, seriously, this house. How much would this house have costed? Seriously, this family must be freaking rich. Super rich. Or maybe there's no one wanted this. Oh. This is only the kitchen now? Longest winded house ever. Where's this go? Is it back this way? What? Ah, okay, I see. I see. Stop! I would not be able to live in it. I don't care if, like, you get this big of a house. I would not be able to live in it if I always heard stuff like that. Going in here first. Oh, let's give me another tape in here. Pack of cards. Pack of cards. And then another tape. Batmobile comes special. I don't want to listen. Let's kill. Is this, if this is just music, I'm taking it out immediately. Yep. Sorry, this is too. It's too weird, man. Uh, in the freezer, get on the floor. Everybody walk the dinosaur. Ah, oh, feels so nice on the nice summer heat. Mm. I don't really know what I expect to find in a freezer, but you know what? Even though I've been leaving stuff open just so I know what I've looked in and what I haven't, I can't leave the freezer open. That just mean. So I'm schedule working at Crown Burger on blah, blah, blah. Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, 3 p.m. to 7 p.m. Mr. and Mrs. Blah 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 request the honor of presence of the marriage of the daughter Helen Margaret to Mr. Richard. Oh. So. Oh. Maybe she was. Maybe they're both cheating? I don't know. I'm really confused. And she's like, yeah, we're just totally friends. <laughs> Whoa, oh god, that scared me for a second. I don't know why. It's just a freaking banana. Calm down, Chris. Calm down. Right, close the doors. Right, close that. Samantha and Daniel were in the woods one day. It was sunny and they were on an adventure, but they went to the something part of the woods, the dark, but I don't know. And they got dark! And Daniel said, Are you scarred? So, is there another person in this family I don't know about? So Samantha said, No. You know what? This is the father's writing. <laughs> Are you? They laughed and then went more into the, the 
back part of the wood, and then it was never meant to be a part of it, but there was never before, and then there was a ship, a pirate ship, on an ocean. Samantha said, I'll be the captain, you be the first mate. Daniel said, I, I, captain. Oh, maybe this is a story she wrote a long time ago. Or maybe this is just the father's writing. He's, he's resorted to being a fool. Daniel finally came over to get his game. I'd finally. been dreading it. But he brought this story with him that I wrote when we were little. I started reading it. And then there I was, crying wow. at the kitchen table. He asked what was wrong, and I was thinking about how we used to be friends. How much I take him for granted. But instead, I told him about What's school. Yeah. And dad. And Lonnie. Open, close. And then how sorry I was that I wasn't his friend anymore. He gave me a hug and said it was going to be okay. And for some reason, I almost believed him. Come on. Oh, my up. Oh, I jammed it with the plate there. <laughs> okay, then. What's what, what was that? How come that lit up? Hello? Hello? Poor Daniel. So maybe she was in love with another guy before. Maybe this is all just a phase. Maybe. How come that lights up sometimes? I can't freaking God close. Come on. I know you light up. And this house is bigger than I thought. I thought maybe it was gonna be the last episode, but it's not looking like it. Okay, well I'm gonna assume it would that would have been easier to open up if there was something actually there. Why is this house all deranged? Well I guess I did just move here still. But still cooking. Anything else in here? These guys have a lot of freaking chips. You guys gotta tone it down on the fatty foods. It's unhealthy for you. You should know better. You should know better. Okay. Nothing in there. Aha! There we go. Uh, uh, having received four more receptors letter, I would congratulate on your new possession of our regional conservation and the Star Service. We wish you good luck in the following weeks. I'm very much looking forward to welcoming you to the new state. Neat! What's the date on this? For, okay, well it's June, so this is all like pretty old news, I guess. Yep, I don't know why I even bother trying that phone. We all knew. Yeah, this is June. Um, Katie comes home this month. We'll call with exact dates. We'll call with exact Oh, as in she'll call. I thought, I thought that meant like she's going to add the date on the calendar or something. Can't make it send, send regrets. Oh. Is this the wedding? Rick's wedding. Anniversary trip. Uh, charity work pick up. Dentist Sam. Forest ro Forest Loop. Tragic hike event. Okay. Church potluck. Something elementary public. Erin says okay. Well, that, that was weird. I I thought there was gonna be something special there, but I guess not. Okay, this is story. It's weird how this is blinking twelve. Normally, when the power goes out, it starts blinking twelve, and then it starts counting the time, even if it's wrong. What's this? Okay, this is his dad's second book. It looks like with Illuminati eye over here. All right. No, unknown Dimension Limited, sixty-four, sixty-four. Maybe that's his thing. Maybe it's 64. Oh, you know, I bet it is. Because we've seen that number a few times. I want to go check that now. No, I'm going to go check that. I'm going to put it in 64, 64 after we're done with this room anyways. I don't know when this game ends. I don't want to go there. Because I don't really... Maybe we'll end up back that way. Oh, although it's pretty close, isn't it? That's really not that far away. Okay. You know what? I'll be right back. And I'll see you guys back at the dad's office in a second. All right, here we go. Now let's try 64, 64. Oh, I thought for sure that was gonna be it, cause that's number show up a few times now, and that seems to be the place her dad, like that's that's the company he's been writing for. So at least the address of it. It's four letters. Did say anything over here that could be useful? No. All right. Sit back to time dust. 1963. Let's try that. My eyes itchy. Eh, eh. Oh, there we go. 1963. Oops. 1963. 
Okay, well, it was worth a try. Okay. And we're back. Okay. Alright, so we. Oh, oh! Don't try to hide from me. What? Seriously, every other time we've been able to pick up notes from the garbage, and this is the first time where we can't. Okay, turn on that light, please. Thank you. This is a garage? Looks like a garage. Dear Mr. Grimmer, first, I hope this is the massive find. Let's say that I hope this missive finds you. Message? I think it's supposed to say message. Finds you a hell. It feels like a goddamn miracle. I find you at all. Did you know how long it took to track you down? We're already not. We are, we are at the feds. My men in black, or any other sort of creeping, fascist hobgoblins in the fact we're on your side. Let me start from the beginning. Unknown Dimension is what you might call a specialist publishing house. We traffic in the weird, the ahead of its time, the lost but not forgotten, but a small um, but dedicated group of plugged in biblio bibliophiles. Heads on the map. Okay, fire on preload run. Okay, but I discover your accidental series of church on. Oh! Huh. So it looks like this is like a group of people that want to. that like his stuff. No matter that, like, like you know, the. Um. Correct list of history. Okay. I have type plenty. What do you want from you? We want permission to reprint the work since your original publisher, Mercury Books, full out a decade ago. We want you to supply a new forward to the. Oh, cool! Um, hmm. Neat. We look forward to embarking with you. Ah, cool. Neat. Okay, so it seems this company wants to write for him the accidental pariah. Alright, neat. Paint can. Why? What? Why? Why was this okay? Well, I, guess, I don't know why I'm asking. Why can I pick this up when it's, I've been able to pick up a lot of stupid, pointless things? Whoa! Yeah, tumble! <laughs> I just wanted to cause ruin to all paint cans everywhere. Why is it? Who put a note here? Brother and I will be away for a, for a long weekend celebrating our anniversary, June third, the seventh. We will be. Um, camping in the gorge, but we'll give you a call on the way home. Sorry, the kitchen is still. Why do I get the feeling? <sighs> I'm hoping Sam just ran away, but considering the attic has the lights on, which means don't come up here, that just makes me think she's gonna be dead up there. What's this? Comburger Sam, ask me about clown combos. Yeah, it looks like she quit. That's why it's in the garbage can. Put it on there. No, it's not. Some grab a can. These are all those cans. Is there anything like paper in here? What's that? Some in the corner there. Looks like a note. Is it? I cannot see the note. Okay, I'm assuming it's not. It'd be easier to pick up if it was important. That bike, go. Okay. Okay. So I'm starting to think Sam might have killed herself. Maybe she just ran away, but the, why would the lights be on? That means do not come in the attic. Which leads me to believe she might be up there and she might be dead. What? Why was this panel left? Where are we now? Lonnie had her going away show with her band tonight. She's so incredible on stage. When she was singing, I could practically forget everything. That we only had 48 hours left. That I don't know what comes next. Oh, she totally had the, the sexual I can't things live with without her. her. Oh no. Then she dedicated the last song to me. And I couldn't take it. I was out on the curb in the alley, sobbing till my ribs hurt. I would follow her anywhere, Katie. But I can't. Where she's going. Join the army too. Screw After it. a long time, she found me. She said she was sorry. She said, I wish things could be different. I just wanted to make you happy. I said, I don't think you can anymore. Oh. Okay, well. 
There we go. Okay, I'm now satisfied. I did flush it on the cutscene. We could barely hear it, and you have to listen to it flushing, guys. You just have to. Alright. Open washer. Is there anything like a freaking crumpled note here? I know you're in there, crumpled note. Don't even act like you're not. Seriously, bro. What's this say? The s what? The slits? Okay, then. Whatever you say. But should I explain it better? The army is this thing I grew up with. It's part of me. My dad's army friends are like my family. I've always um, known it was where I'd end up. I never thought of it any other way. I wish things could be different. Maybe someday when I'm settled out of base you and you're done with college, you're a famous writer, and I can rebuild um, a tank engine with my eyes closed. Things will be different, and then we can be together. Until then, love. With love. With love. Oh, it's so soft. It's so soft. All right, let's open the door. All right. Hello, we're in the greenhouse now. Hello. I got enough of the episode here, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. And I, even though I said last time, this is going to be the last episode, but it's clearly not. Um, this is, seems to be, there's one more door, and I think there's probably one more room behind there. And I think that's probably going to be it. Right? I don't know. Apparently, according to this, there is not even a room there. Okay, but in the next episode, we'll probably finish off the series. Until then, thanks a lot for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.